It's fourth quarter TV, man. Dwayne Robinson, Trilla J. We back again. Uh, we're here to address the it's it's Mookie, Mookie, right? And Slugger T and all mm-hmm. them. Is that their situation? Yeah. Um, Why footage not? came out of the person who allegedly told on Mookie, um, AMP or something like that. Ruthless AMP. Yeah. I think his name on Instagram. I don't. It's Anthony. That's what we gonna call you. We ain't gonna call you no nickname. You lost your nickname rights. Tell the truth, the real truth. What you seen? What you know? They got it on video. She just just tell the truth off. They got it on video. Remember when Mookie went live? They know that. They seen us at Slugger House. They seen us leave Slugger House. Um, dude, he told like, and then so I guess Mookie. So let me catch the people up to date. Why and our Mookie, a rapper from Jacksonville, Florida, is currently uh, serving a ten-year sentence. I think it was a ten-year sentence in prison for a, a gun charge. Gun charges, yeah. Um, it started because he was pulled over. He was on live. Police then pulled him over while he was on live. Uh, the live is on YouTube if you guys want to look. Um, he he was on live, and then I believe they found a gun in the car. Yeah, and then they pinned it on him. It was a long trial. He was in jail a long time before he finally went to court or went to trial. And long story short, he got sentenced to ten years. Um, details came out more and more. A kid named Anthony, who was in the car with him, was the one who provided details to uh, police officials um, about, I guess, whose gun it was or something. Um, Slugger T was also involved. Why and R Slugger T? Um, he is another rapper from Jacksonville who's obviously tied to YNR artists like Spada, Mookie, Fulio at one point had ties to him. Um, Slugger T was also arrested. I'm not too sure the details. Do you know the details on Slugger T? Um, shit. Besides him being locked up for that gun charge and then like some shit going back to where like, you know, 1090J really broke it down. Um, where he had said, I guess, that like they was leaving like their grandma house or something. And then, like, you know, spot him was yeah. part of that, too. Yeah. So that's really what got Slugger T um, knocked out, bro, because, or sent up the road because, you know, he snitched that he had yeah. the gun in the, in yeah. the bathroom. It was then, possession, yep. And then he said, and then, you know, you don't yeah, the, rest, yeah, the rest yeah. of history. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If, if you know, you know. Yeah. Um, Slugger T was, anyways, fast forward to today. Uh, footage came out of uh, AMP telling he told the footage came out he confessed to it all but what made it even worse right like besides the telling is the dude went to the next interrogation room i believe it was either his brother or his friend and he tried to persuade him to snitch i like i i get telling i mean i don't get it but you told cool why you gotta tell the next dude to tell what? <laughs> like tell him peace bro you like don't be out here trying to get everybody involved in what you got going on you feel me and i think that's why people get locked up anyway everybody want to do what somebody else doing people want to tell i don't get it i don't get it informants make like 85k though what was it 85k or 60 yeah. it was 63k in florida wasn't it yeah but you can make that same money working at a at a warehouse or something bro Think about it, though. Right? Think about it. Oh, oh being an informant, like, full-time? Yeah. Oh, okay. Imagine if you only have to give, like, 10 to 12 statements a year and you make $63,000 a year. Would you do it? I'll still work a job. But, yeah, nah, I wouldn't, I, wouldn't do it. Do yeah, nah I wouldn't do I it. Yeah, no, I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't do it. Yeah, no. Nah. Do you think they get paid for it, though? Like, the rappers nowadays? Like, do you think Gunna made money off? Oh, hell no. Nah. Did Gunna snitch, his though? freedom. That, that was probably the he best paid thing. with his freedom. Yeah. He got paid with his life. Yeah, man, I don't know. I don't know. Snitching things taking over the rap game. I don't really like it. Can we get back to the music, man? Let's get back to the music. That's mm. what that's what you that's what this junk need to be about. But it is what it is, man. These folks out here tripping and telling. I'm trying to hear that baby and Nardo song. Man, that that nigga got every baby and Nardo. That they got a lot of songs together. At this point, it's like Nardo and Baby, the new uh, Baby and Gunna. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to hear that. Oh, um, no, though. No. We can't play it, though, because you know they be like um, mm-hmm. Flagging the that copyright, shit. though. I don't know. It's it, It'll be interesting to see, though, how that song turns out. They was lit in Jacksonville. That's for sure. Yeah. 